Well, all month we are spotlighting St. Louis black history and today we're talking about the nationwide Underground Railroad and the black woman who was an influential conductor in St. Louis in the mid 1800s. Sydney Stallworth is joining us live at the Mary Meacham Freedom Site with the name we should all know, Sydney. Michelle, that's exactly right. Mary Meacham, remember that name. She was a free, prominent black woman in St. Louis who was also an abolitionist and a conductor of the Underground Railroad in the 1850s. Now, this mural that you see behind me here along the Mississippi Riverfront is in her honor, but it turns out this isn't even her. Never, ever did we say this was Mary Meacham. Somebody took this out of the collage and made it her. At the Paris Expedition, which was the World's Fair in Paris, Europe wanted to know how the slaves were faring, okay? Uh, a lot of questions, you know, what happened to them? What, you know, what's going on with them? So, W.E.B. Du Bois convinced the federal government at the U.S. Pavilion to be able to, to show what happened. You know, I'm doing all this research and I go, oh, this is interesting. And on one of the walls, one whole wall that he showed business owners in Atlanta, that woman's picture was there. Couldn't find her name anywhere. So yes, this is not Mary Meacham, but we don't have any photos of her. So this woman from Atlanta has come to symbolize her. Now you should know in this very spot in May of 1855, a small group of slaves attempted what became one of the most famous attempts at freedom in Missouri state history. And guess who organized it all? Mary Meacham. I'm going to have the story and tell you what happened all those years ago in our next half hour. But for now, by the riverfront, Sydney Stallworth, five on your side. Thank you, Sydney.